Hey guys, welcome back to All Things Knives, and today we are doing a Shaman scale swap. This is my Z-Wear Sprint Run Shaman with my Carter scales, and I'm actually going to be putting Tarot Tough scales on them, which I've heard is a superior material. I've heard that from a couple people. So let's, uh, let's not waste any more time. If you guys are doing this, I believe all you'll need for the Shaman is a T8, and for the pocket clip... You'll need, well, actually, the pivot might be a T10. So we're going to grab our T10, T8, and T6. Start with the pivot. I'm going to try to do this as fast as possible. That way it's quicker to upload for you guys. So just don't mind me while I'm working. I'm just going to blast through this. Kind of move these up here. Get this under here so you guys can see it. Mm. Switch to the T8. We're basically fully disassembling this guy. So we're just going bit by bit here. Basically gonna pop this whole side off. You should see the scale is gonna come off too. Let's see. Yeah, I'm gonna need T6 for those clip screws. T6. Whoa. Or it'll do that on you. <laughs> there you go. Guess I didn't. What it was is I thought this guy wasn't gonna come out, but it did. Okay, good. Normally, I would apply oil after this, and we're literally going to want to get everything out. So we do still need to remove these screws. Let's see. Just have to get these here. And if there are any little parts... Sorry, I should throw just... Throw those in there, to be honest. Okay. Yeah, you're, you're going to be taking this guy fully apart, so. Let's see, what's this one? T6. T8. A T10 rolled off somewhere, but I'm not really too worried about it. It's probably behind my dish. Like I said, this is speed run, so this... Because larger videos for me are really hard to upload on, on the way I do it. Spider Co., consider this my application to work at your golden factory. <laughs> Obviously, that's a joke, guys. In case you were wondering. Okay. Let's see. We gotta put some liners in this bad boy. So that means. Oh. That did roll off somewhere. We're gonna find that. Because <laughs> I'm gonna need it here in a second. Not too worried about it. I I have other T10s. Yeah. I think it moved when I had my little explosion there. My little explosion fun time. Okay. Line one of those up, and then we need one of these screws. Actually, in all honesty, set your screws first, like so, through the liner and it'll help hold your liner in place. And then I would do the backspacer. Okay. It's gonna need to be the T8. Okay. 
Sorry if some of that was off camera. Some some of it's hard to do with this camera set up in front of me, so pardon again. Most of the time when I do this, I'm off camera. <laughs> so I have all the li you know all the liberty in the world to move or whatever. So gonna want that stop pin in there. That is crucial to the design of the knife. You know, some would say it is elemental. Okay, we're good to set that guy down because it's basically secure where it is. Put that. Uh, you know what? Might almost be, no. We're gonna do stop collar next. For the stop collar, you should see a side that's flat. Yeah, and then you're gonna put that flat side on the other flat side, like so, with the washer in between. So see how that's in there? Now we are going to take one of these and at least get part of our liner. Oh, sorry, sorry guys. Uh, at least get part of our liner. See what I'm doing there, stop collar there. Tightening that. Okay, so that basically holds that on there. What's next is the blade. We're just gonna, here. Let's, I'm gonna move my bowl off to the side. And okay, that's suitable for you guys to see, I think. Okay, so we gotta do this perfectly upright. Let's see. Oh. Actually, if you really want, best thing to do, take this bad boy and just put it there. There we go. Okay, so we got that stop pin there. I'm gonna take this guy. Really all you need for the shaman is uh, T8, if you guys are seeing this. And a T6 for the those clip screws, man. They're what's holding me back. Look at that. We're only seven minutes in. We're basically basically good to go. Ooh, <laughs> I like that. There's some blade play, but that's negotiable, I'd argue. Better centering with these scales <laughs> than before. Won't hear me complain about that. These are definitely more square, but I like the tarot tough. I'm not gonna lie. I'm... First impression of the tarot tough is, uh, I like the way it feels. It definitely feels you know, not as much like a uh, natural materia, as much as the micarta does. You know, it feels like there's definitely some uh, artificiality to it. If that's a real word or not. <laughs> Occasionally you gotta make up your own words, guys. And that's okay. Okay. Do not disappoint me now, shaman. Why is it, uh, why is it doing that? Maybe it's, these aftermarket screws. Sorry guys, it just looks like the... I might need to use different screws. Okay, for now we're, we're gonna leave that there and I'm gonna figure out that pocket clip off camera. Let you guys get a look at these scales with them on. 
in all honesty, I might even just leave the uh, clip off and throw the leather lanyard on. That they they do include a leather lanyard, so that actually feels very nice. Slim handles on the Shaman. Oh, sorry. Feels very good. Very well balanced. Nice texture to it. I like it. We're liking it. Action is good. A little bit of blade play, but as we were saying earlier, that's negotiable. And by negotiable, I mean I can, I can tweak this. I'm not saying I, you know, I, I, I hate a knife that has blade play. You know, if if the knife is off center, but it's sturdy as can be, I'd, I could care less. But if it's off center and it goes side to side, that's when I'm upset. Solid. And the centering is better than it was before, to be honest. That centering used to be worse. Yeah. Maybe throw some Loctite. I probably need to throw some Loctite in this bad boy, to be honest. All right. We are going to call that good. Let me know what you guys think of the way this Terra Tough looks. I really like it. It's going to be a nice neutral color, you know, kind of match my jeans, khakis, whatever I'm wearing. You know, and by khakis, I mean like, you know, like your tan colored cargo shorts or tan. I have a pair of tan jeans, which I really enjoy wearing. Let me know what you guys think. This was a speed run, so I did a complete scale swap in 11 minutes, if you don't count the time that I was, uh, you know, talking to you guys. Had some technological mishaps, but, you know, it's expected to happen. Anyways, leave a comment down below. These are from Fireside uh, Scale Co. They do a really good job. I love the feel of the Tarot Tough. I'm going to let you guys know how the Tarot Tough does, and I should be having some more hitting the channel. Uh, with this Terra Tough stuff that I can get some real use on. So anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Like, comment, share, subscribe if you're not subscribed. And as always, stay sharp.